Take all your things, you go and run and hide. Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. Well, I'm Peter Drury and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Beglin. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. business here. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Julio Cesar's the man. Just keep an eye out for his kicking and general distribution. It's seriously good and he can get his team on the front foot very quickly through that accurate passing. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Now it's Jonas. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Boots it upfield. Out to the flank, here it comes. Firmly met. Shot a goal! That carries quite a threat. but couldn't steer it in. Oh, this has been such a positive approach from them in the early part of this game. Everybody is programmed to get forward, and despite a couple of failed attempts, they are the better side. And the defence can get it clear. Neither side yet able to find the net. He's made on the ball. Swept in. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Mitroglu. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Now the pass. And it will be a throw in. So what now? Into the channel. Cuts it back. Great delivery and a finish to match. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had.
Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, that's put him in the driving seat, but there's a lot of football left in this one yet, believe me. Balls out on the left, now. Has gone out. They've scored near to half-time to give them a 1-0 lead. It's a long forward pass. Now it's Eliseu, Eliseu. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. He's had a look. Mitroglu is flagged offside. <laughs> and that'll be the final action of the first half. I'm sure they'll be very happy with their first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Leading a cagey game here, it's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. Here we go again. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Mitroglu. Tries a through ball. Mitroglu. So still just a goal between them. Well, they could break here. Cuts it out. Jonas knocks it towards the front. Mitroglu, it's anyone's ball. It's a bit promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Looks like a good ball through. Looking to shoot. It's in. Two up. Threatening to pull clear. <laughs> he was urged to shoot and he duly delivered. I just think that's a good example of how you take advantage of a lapse in concentration. He was on the prowl, hungry, looking for any scraps that came his way. And he certainly gobbled up the chance, took it really well. Benfica have a sub ready to come on. Well, at 1-0 this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Passes it through. And out to safety. Tarat. Just a quarter of an hour to play. Luisao. Salvio. Mitroglu. Jonas. Plays it out to the flank. This is promising. Oh, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's shown us. Salvia. Now it's Mitroglu. Mitroglu! Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. And very well to intervene. 
Looks to slip it through. Looks like a good ball through. Wonderful quick feet. Oh, that's not going to find its target. So that's it. It is all over. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That is the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient, and it's all paid off. Well, thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.